everybody, what's going on? Jerome here, and welcome to the first episode of Stardew Valley. Now, this is a game that Ben recommended to me. I don't know anything really about it. Well, Ben and Steve recommended it to me. Uh, I don't really know anything about it, except that it's kind of like Minecrafty in a way, but you can go between different uh, planets, and it's also like a farming simulator, and it's weird. So, anyway, name Jerome. We're already doing a good job of this game. We already filled out our name and everything. Uh, farm name. Baca land farm. No, I'll just call it Baca farm. Favorite thing. What, this, is, this is a tough question. <laughs> what is my favorite thing? Um, doggo. <laughs> All right. Let's see the different skin colors here. Uh, oh, I was blue. See some purple, some weird color. Uh, purple and green and blue. Well, we'll pick one. Seems pretty typical. Hair. Oh, I like the I like the third. I like that. That's a cool one. That's a cool one. We'll do that one. And shirt. Was that Luigi? Oh my god, that's like Luigi's trousers. Oh, we are so being Luigi. There we go. And <gasps> beard. Yes, he needs a beard. Let's see. <laughs> yeah, I'll give him that beard right there. And we can hit okay. Oh, pants color and everything. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. And hair color is probably okay. That's about right. I'm colorblind, so we'll just roll with it. All right. Get ready to play, everybody. This is it. Remember to smash that like button and subscribe as well if you're new. And not only that, if you guys want to get the sneak preview of this every time before we go live, then the easiest thing to do is follow me on Mixer. Link's in the description. That's where I do all this stuff firsthand. So, and for my very special grandson, I want you to have this sealed envelope. Ooh. So we're getting a sealed envelope now. What's it say? What, what's inside the sealed envelope? I want you to have the sealed envelope. No, no, don't open it yet. Have patience. Okay, I don't have any patience. Now listen close. Oh God, what's he gonna tell us? What are you gonna tell us? There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> All right, I didn't, didn't realize we were getting deep. Didn't realize that that's the way we were going. And your bright spirit will fade before a groaning empty- <laughs> What? Uh, okay. When that happens, my boy, you'll be ready for this gift. Now let grandpa rest. Yeah, that was like really creepy. All right, 20 years later. Is that Woody? That's Woody from Toy Story. Oh, oh, that guy in the right isn't looking too good. I don't think he got a lunch break when he was supposed to have. Uh, oh, that's us. That character's us. Apparently, we are thirsty. If you're reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I lost sight of what mattered most in life. Real connections with other people in nature. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. I've enclosed the deed to that place. My pride and joy, Baca Farm. It's located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. It's the perfect place to start your new life. This is my most precious gift of all. And now it's yours. I know you'll honor the family name, my boy. Good luck. Love, Grandpa. P.S. If Lewis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will you? That's it. Is that everything? All right. We're going to Stardew Valley! Apparently that's how the game starts. Cute little bird just lands out of nowhere. Okay, what? Okay, those are some weird noises. I'm getting very disturbed by the noises. Robin. Hello, you must be Jerome. I'm Robin, the local carpenter. Mayor... This is like a very loud game. Mayor Lewis sent me here to fetch you and show you the way to your new home. He's there right now, tidying things up for your arrival. The farm's right over here if you'll follow me. Okay, let's do that. What's the matter? Sure, it's a bit overgrown, but there's some good soil underneath that mess. With a little dedication, you'll have it cleaned up in no time. Okay. I just want to get the menu screen so I can turn the music back off because I can't hear anything! Sorry, I know you guys can hear everything, but it's very loud in my ears. It's because I lowered it down on your end so that you guys don't have to suffer. But I'm still suffering! Alright, open up. Hello, random guy. Ah, the new farmer. Welcome, I'm Lewis, mayor of the Pelican Town. You know, everyone's been asking about you. It's not every day that someone new moves in. It's quite a big deal. Oh, that's good. So you're moving into your grandfather's old cottage. It's a good house, very rustic. Rustic? That's one way to put it. Crusty might be a little more apt though. Whoa, okay, Robin. Very rude. Look at her laughing. That was a rude statement, don't laugh. Don't listen to her, Jerome. She's just trying to make you dissatisfied so you buy one of her house upgrades. Oh! Is that it, Robin? You trying to sell house upgrades? Anyway, you must be tired from the long jersey. journey. You should get some rest. Tomorrow, you ought to explore the town a bit and introduce yourself. Okay. Um. Well, then we will do that. The townspeople would appreciate that. 
Aw. Alright. I feel like a member of Stardew Valley already. Oh, I almost forgot. If you have anything to sell, just place it in this box here. I'll come by during the night to collect it. Well, good luck. Okay. Interesting. So I guess you collect stuff and you put it in the box and it auto-sells for you. Once Mayor Lewis gets it. Shift is run. Oh, right-click is check. We got parnip seeds. All right. Or parsnip seeds. Seeds. Parsnip. Uh, here's a little something to get you started, Mayor Lewis. Uh, let's pick it. Oh, okay, nice. You can mine that stuff up to get it out of the way. I get it. So you just got to clean up your land then for now. And then you got to try and plant your, uh, plant your crops. Okay. Um, what is it called? Oh, look at that. That works really well. All right. So what if I just started planting this stuff down like right here? So let's do, apparently that's not a good area to plant. It's red. Okay. Where's a good area to plant? How do I find a good area to plant? I wish this game had a little more explanation. What's this? Journal. Getting started. If you want to become a farmer, you have to start with the basics. Use your hoe to till the soil, then use a seed packet on the tilled so soil to sow a crop. Water every day until the crop is ready to harvest. Okay. Cultivate and harvest a parsnip. That's what it's telling us to do. All right. And introductions is my other quest. It would be nice to your soldiers around town. Introduce uh, some people might be anxious to meet the new farmer. Okay. Well, let's worry about this. So let's use the hoe. If you can cut grass and hay, you can build a silo. How do I how do I use this to till the land though? All right, let's let's carve out all this area. Because just unruly amounts of everything in the way. There we go. Look at that. Everything will be nice and watered. And I guess in a few days' time it'll be good. But while it's still daytime, and being we already planted our crops, and we cleaned out a good amount of our land as well, I'm going to go and try and greet some of the neighbors here. Let's see what they're all up to. Get out of here, Rock. Can I sell? Well, first off, let's see what I can sell. I wonder if I can sell stone and wood. I think I can. I have no clue if that stuff will sell or not, but we are trying to cultivate and harvest them. Water it every day until it's... See? What is, my, is that my energy bar? Is that, like, how much energy I have left until I fall asleep? Uh, well, here's a hospital. Let's go and see if we can get inside. Hello. Greetings, person. Muscle remedy? No, and I certainly can't afford any of that stuff. I just wanted to come say hi. Oh, come on. Isn't that greeting them? I mean, I met that guy. It's kind of like greeting him. But apparently it doesn't count. All right, let's go here. Oh, hello, person. No, talk to me. There we go. Hey, I'm Sam. Good to meet you. Okay, great to meet you too, Sam. Is that really part of the game? I just gotta go meet them? Hi. Hello, Leah. Nice to meet you, too. I gotta do this 28 more times. I think I might cry. Hello, random person. And you are... Hi, Penny. Let's see. Are these all counting as introductions? Yeah, 5 of 18 people. Alright, let's go break into someone's house. I'm sure, that's a great way to introduce yourself. Hey, how's it going? Sorry I broke in. You're gonna love it here in Pelican Town. If you're ever looking for something to do in the evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work. Okay, Emily. And you're not good enough for the Haley to enter her bedroom. Well, I, yeah, I probably would agree with that. I mean, I don't even know who Haley is, so it's probably fair. You're not good enough for the Emily to enter her. I broke well, fair statements all around there. Very fair. All right. Let's go this way. Hello, Blue House. New people. Hi, I'm here to break into your house. Oh, a stranger. My name is Vincent. Mama says not to talk to strangers, but you seem okay. Yeah, but your mom's probably right. Oh, you are exactly how I imagine, but that's okay. I'm Jody. Hello, Jody. Just coming to break in here. No, no one else in here to meet. Okay, see you later. Bye. Don't care about any of you. So I still don't even get the point of this game. I just supposed to grow crops and meet people. Ah, person. Hello. It wasn't in vain coming all the way out here. Oh, you're the new farmer boy, aren't you? Wait, Haley now wants to talk to me? Wasn't that? Oh, I just had to wait for her to be done with her camera. I guess you had to wait for like late at night or something. Uh, oh, I'm Haley. Is that it? If I weren't for those horrendous clothes, you might actually be cute. Wow! Alrighty there, Haley. Don't want to talk to you anymore. This, these clothes are awesome. I made them myself. I wanted to look like Luigi. Green Mario. You know? Well, it's getting to be 6.40 p.m. I don't know when the sun sets in this game, but I can't imagine it being much longer than that. So we might want to head back to our house and see what we can do from there. Well, head back to town anyway, and then the house. Why not? All right. So we've already been there and there. Where else in town can I meet people? 
Oh, well, this person seems to live at the cemetery. Seems like a really bad place to live. Oh, is that the mayor? It's Lewis! How do you represent the old cottage? Okay, well, I don't know why you live at the cemetery, but very gross, weird. All right, let's go downtown, apparently. Ooh, a fisherman's shack. Okay. It's locked. What's this say? Hmm, with 300 pieces of wood, this could be fixed. Ooh, is that a new quest? Oh, I was hoping that'd be a new quest. There's gotta be a way to meet all these people quicker than this. Because, like, how am I supposed to mentally have this area mapped out? Alright, let's see. Hello. I'll be back tomorrow, gone fishing. It's 8 p.m. already! Can I just break in your house at night? It's locked. Open 8 a.m. to 6 I had that feeling. Yeah, it's too late. So we have to go to bed, I guess. And then we can probably go, you know, talk with all these other townspeople. They're probably all sleeping, so leave them be. Uh, all right. So we'll head down this way. And we got mail! How do I access the... There we go. Hello there. Just got back from a fishing trip. You should come down to the beach sometime. I've got something for you. Oh, nice! That's where... To the beach! That member, uh... That's where we just were. We wanted to visit him there. Uh, but he wasn't awake. Alright, so we'll take care of this. And we'll go visit our soon-to-be hopeful friend. Um... Oh, the Star Drop Saloon. Let's go in there, because we haven't been there yet. And let's go say hi to people. It's locked. Well, actually, to be fair, if a saloon was open before 12 in the afternoon, I'd be kind of thoroughly concerned about the 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 status of alcoholism in this community. <laughs> so maybe it is a good thing that the saloon does not open until the afternoon, and not 7 in the morning. <laughs> All right, let's go down here. I think this was the way to the beach anyway, right? Let's see. Yes, it was! Hello, person on the docks. How's it going, friend? Well, this is really creepy. Willie, ahoy there, son. Heard there was a newcomer town. Good to finally meet you. Ah, I'm still trying to unwind from a month out on the salty seas. It was a big haul. I sold a lot of good fish. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. Okay. Here, I want you to have my old fishing rod. It's important to me that the art of fishing stays alive. And hey, maybe you'll buy something from the shop once in a while. Okay. We got a fishing rod! Thanks! Weird guy Willie, you received a bamboo pole. Alright. There's good water here in the valley, all kinds of fish. Aw, nice. Oh yeah, my shop's back open now, so come by if you need supplies. I'll also buy anything you catch. If it smells, it sells. Eh, that's what my old pappy used to say anyway. Okay. Cool. Well, let's do that then. Oh, hello there, seagulls. Uh, well, I mean, we got this. We might as well go fishing, right? Let's see. How do I know what to do? When do I pull it in? Oh, wait. Let me pull it. Wait. All right, there we go. A hit! Click to raise the bar. Oh, we gotta beat him out. There we go. Did I win? Am I- am I winning? Oh god! Oh god, I accidentally clipped off screen! Did we get him? We got a sardine! Hello, sir! I- I wanna sell my- I wanna sell the sardine to you! No, I don't wanna go fishing- there, okay. Well, apparently- apparently I can't sell the stuff yet. But, that is very funny. We got a sardine! We did it! We deserve this! All right. Well, I think that right there, everybody, is going to be where I call this one quits for the day. This is my first ever episode of this series, so hopefully you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. In the meantime, though, I want you to smash that like button. Be sure to subscribe as well. Check out my Spore series and follow me on Mixer down below in the description. That way you guys can be notified every time I go live over there. And uh, you guys can get the sneak preview of these videos before they become videos. Take care, friends. Thank you again.